Uh, but here's another question. How have HR transformations changed entry-level roles and therefore impacted early career programs, rotational programs? I think, Jeff, we got into that a little bit when we talked about, you know, many companies are moving away from HR generalist roles for entry-level folks because they're either, um, you know, centralizing a lot of those duties into the shared service environment, and then how do you build those foundational experiences and, and develop people for those most senior level HRBP roles without having the same level of foundation? So maybe share a little more on that. Yeah, so it, a lot of the entry level roles are coming in in terms or into these rotational programs, and it's been more targeted at the COE to, to build this uh, foundational experience. Um, and then in addition to that, I think, I think um, one of the things that came up a lot was um, with, with a lot of like the responsibilities being pulled out of these entry level roles and going into different functions, um, like how are we using that time that we have um, to work more strategically, even as an entry level uh, professional. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. The other thing I thought was easy, and you, you uh, not, are not easy, but interesting, was when you laid out the statistics around that and said, you know, half of the companies. Uh, really, you know, feel like some of those foundational experiences that you got through an HR generalist role were not as important in the future, and and half half did seem to think yeah. it's still important to give them some exposure to that. And I think then we're rotating them right through the through the shared service here environment as well as COEs and, yeah, and generalists. I, I think it depended on what the company was doing with shared services at that time, and um, you know, like some companies may have out, outsourced some of the roles that used to be part of that generalist mm -hmm. model, and there may not even be the opportunity to take on some of that role. Yeah. Um, so like some companies that were doing that, for example, would put an early career professional into managing those programs. So uh, that was one, one way that we that's, saw that yeah, being that's done. Right, that's good. 